How many of us have recited the Quran? How many of us can comfortably say that we know a meaning of a verse of the Quran or a surah from the Quran? Or we've reflected over certain verses and extracted lessons. Allah is encouraging us to do that. The Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam did that along with recitation. So if we haven't, let us promise ourselves and let us make a pact that inshallah this Ramadan at least, even if it comes to one verse or one chapter in the Quran, even if it's the shortest chapter in the Quran, I am going to go over it, I'm going to recite it. If my recitation is not correct, let me go to a sheikh, let me study with somebody because this is part of the Quran. Do you know that the Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, every Ramadan, he would go over the Quran with somebody. Who was this? Jibreel or Jibreel Alayhi Salaam. This angel Alayhi Salaam, they would come and gather in order to do what? In order to go over the Quran, in order to recite the Quran. Yet, the best of creation, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the best angel they would gather in order to go over the Quran, they would recite the Quran. And it's mentioned in the hadith, again recorded in Sahih al-Bukhari, that the Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was the most generous person. And his generosity was most felt in the month of Ramadan when Jibreel Alayhi Salam used to meet him in order to learn the Quran. What can we derive from this? If you want to be a person of the Quran, or a trait of the people of the Quran is that they are generous.